Welcome back, my friends, to our playthrough of Pokemon Legends Arceus. Let us move on. We've got a handful of objectives we got to take care of, but let's first uh, swing by over here and see what we get from this guy. Or woman, I suppose. I don't know. I can't really tell. <laughs> He's not even making eye contact with me. All right. If a Pokemon starts eyeing me, I'll fling an Orenberry, then run while it's distracted. If I just stick to the plan, I'll be fine. Oh, okay. It is a guy. Oh, Survey Corps boy. I was just headed out to the field lands to go gather tumble stones, but I haven't got as many orange berries as I'd like. Are you familiar? They restore some HP to Pokemon that eat them. So, as you might imagine, Pokemon tend to be very interested in them. You see where I'm going with this? Throwing orange berries is a great way to distract and avoid wild Pokemon. They're indispensable. That in mind, can I tell you to gather five orange berries for me? <laughs> They're indispensable. Can you please give me some? <laughs> yeah, let's just give them to him since we're right here. Feel a lot better having more orange berries. Would you be able to give me just five of them? Sure, there we go. I gratefully accept. Gosh, I can't believe you went all the trouble of finding these just for me. I didn't. I already had them. <laughs> Not really, but thank you. Gosh, you're nice for someone who fell out of the sky. Let's just tuck these away in my satchel. I won't let your kindness go to waste. Wish me luck with those tumble stones. Uh, oh, three revivals. So you better give me something out of that. I have a lot of stuff we have to do, and I think my Pokemon are, like, super-duper weak. Um, let's take a look. I always do this wrong. Let's see. Cyndaquil's level 16. Need to boost him to 17. Oh, Starly's ready to evolve. Let's take a look and see what we got there. Can I... Okay, select. Evolve. There we go. Yeah. Wow, what a dramatic evolution. Star Radio! Very cool. That was nice. A little uh, excessively dramatic, but I'm fine with that. Okay, how's our health? Everybody's looking good there. Leveling-wise. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I think we're in good shape. Um, Let me see. How do I... You know what? Let me double check and see. What can I do? Let's see. What was it? It's not this. Key items. Dang, I don't remember now. Uh, no? Hmm. Yeah, whatever. I'm trying to remember how to make items, and I totally have forgotten. How are things, my good friend? I certainly hope you're putting that secret backstrike... <laughs> sorry, that secret backstrike technique I taught you to good use. Actually, I've been. It's been very useful. Either way, I have some super potions here just for you. Oh, think nothing of it. Having the Survey Corps out and about studying Pokemon is great for business, you know. Supporting you now is actually an investment in my own fortunes. Okay, 100 HP. Yeah, I'm gonna need that. And now I must depart. There are ruins that are just calling to me. Man, I'm really looking forward to the prospect of, like, future games that have really advanced ruins and puzzles and stuff. Man, this is already a pretty peaceful and enjoyable game. I'm really liking what I've seen so far. We've only scratched the surface. But even with that... I can't help but think of the possibilities of what future games designed around this model are going to be like. They're going to be truly exceptional. Uh, it's assuming that they continue doing things like this. Heading outside the village, are we? Stay safe out there, kid. Yeah, we still only have just this place. I love that art. Man, I would love to get a painting of this. Like, that actual art style is very nice. Very cool. Um, we're gonna go to Heights Camp. We have a lot of, uh, training we need to do in terms of leveling up. I need to get a Quillava bad. Cyndaquil needs to evolve. Okay, so they're chilling here. I wonder... Hold on. There was something... I think. I don't know why, but I thought, where the heck is the option to make these? I, I haven't played this game in a couple of days because I've been super busy. And we're finally getting around to it, and I don't remember how to make those items. Maybe I can't. That's why it's giving me this object, this problem here. Whatever. Let's see. Does it let me make some from right here, I wonder? Hmm. All right, whatever. Switching the team. Uh, 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 yeah. Okay, 
Okay, so Star Radio. What level are these guys at? Probably pretty low. Four, two, four. Four. Two, three. We had, um... Drifloon's considered a flying. That's a really unique ghost icon. I don't remember seeing that before. I don't think I really need a flying type Pokemon. I'm thinking. Well, we have Ponyta, so I don't really need Ponyta because it's a fire type. I don't need that again. Nine, ten, nine. Okay, whatever. That's okay. Nine, seven. Might as well get the experience from getting multiple evolutions, yeah? Okay, so we have two electrics, Shinx and Pichu. Flying normal, rock and ground, ghost and flying. Uh, our team isn't great, but it's... I don't know, it's alright. Right now, I think what we need to do the most is worry about getting uh, Cyndaquil up to Quilava. And I think that should be our primary focus first, because if we're going to go take on Cleaver, which I'm really looking forward to doing, I don't, I'm, I'm not sure if we'll be able to catch it, but I'm hoping that we can. Like I said, I don't know if it's going to be possible, but maybe. Yeah, this game is going to have some really great moments. I wonder, can I throw you up there? up there, huh? Oh, well. Oh, hey. This army of Geodude is not really what I want to spend my time doing, but, um, let's collect a few items. What do we got here? fast. Level 8. Ah, oh, come on. Damn. If it runs away, though, and we attack, we should be able to get a little experience out of that, right? Or is that just me? That rock over there is shaking. Probably a geodude in there. <laughs> that was pretty sweet. Alright, light him up. I wonder if rollout's gonna do decent damage. Yes. I want that XP. Before we can take on Cleaver, we gotta... I lost Satchel. How is it... How is it already sent back to Maven? The fact that I found that, that's very lucky. Oh, we caught him unawares. I'm surprised about that too. Looked like he saw me, or she, rather. Roll out. Level 10 would did a KO. That should be a one hit KO. Need to farm the experience as much as possible. Alright, a bug Pokemon should be weak against a fire attack. Level 8 Krikatot. Wait, it ran away? You weak. Punk. Come on, fight it. Don't run. Let me burn you. We just need to fight. One attack, fire, that should be enough to torch it. KO. I want I want Cyndaquil to be up to four, I guess. The lava, technically. Level 20 before we get up to Cleaver, because I'm really worried that we're gonna get stomped big time. Ah. 
I was gonna say, we, there's no way we don't get fall damage off that jump. That was ridiculous. Cricket Dot's too weak. I'm not really worried about it attacking me with my back turned. Come on, get it before it runs. Just knocking out Pokemon left and right. Their corpses are everywhere. Getting better at throwing these Pokeballs. It's not a lot of XP, but it's something. 25. We're almost there. Gets a little XP for knocking those rocks loose as well. And we have a bunch of items that we can get from here, too. How is it unawares? Like, Starly straight up saw me. Rollout seems to be really ideal against flying type Pokemon. Which shouldn't surprise me. But it does coming from a fire type. He's about to level up, maybe? Come on, don't run away. The battle, the battle system is so much more unique than past games that I'm actually not minding... Yeah, he's ready to evolve, yeah. Um, I'm not minding the repetitiousness of it because it's just so fresh and it's fast. We're able to get through and knock out Pokemon after Pokemon after Pokemon so much more quickly than ever before. We've never uh, been able to do that. These wild encounters, like, it's just... It's rapid, rapid, rapid. Bam, 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 bam. Love that. Oh, tch. We should evolve our Pokemon, shouldn't we? Oh, I guess we can just straight up evolve from here, huh? So dramatic. <laughs> it's great animation, though. Okay, I part, part of me thought maybe Quilava would look a little bit different since Typhlosion has a regional variation here but apparently not yeah the fire ghost type is going to be an interesting uh experience for us but i just wish he didn't look like he had like i don't know he looks very slow he looks uh like he has a learning disability Explosion, I mean. We're just gonna throw a Pokeball at this one. Because we didn't have it, come on. Yeah. Those Pokeball animations are delightful. Nice. Damn, I don't know what I was thinking. We could probably start inching our way a little closer. Um, Pichu, hook it up. You got Thundershock, right? You're leveled up enough. Nice. Beautiful. Elemental advantages. Crushing it. Well done. Weasels over there. Yeah, we should also use Pichu to take care of these Starly. Flying types are weak against electrics, so as long as Starly stays in the... Oh, you jerk. I knew that was going to happen. Does Pichu have a different animation? Eh, it's just different enough. Oh god, that thing. I don't know if I can beat that alpha... I want to try. But I don't know if I can. We're going to find out, though. That's a pretty beautiful Thundershock. I love that move. They did do a lot of care, at least, in some of those moves. Um, Okay, let's do this. Okay, I just want to save it first. 
and then see how well this goes. Oh, he attacked me even though I was able to... Oh my god! That's... Yeah, we're not going to stand a chance. Time to go. Yeah, PG fainted. Hell yeah, it did. Yeah, some other time is absolutely right. Makes sense that Floatzel's chilling around this, like, small herb of... Oh, God, is it still here? It hit me? Oh, maybe it's something else that hit me. Oh, yeah, that was that weasel. Floatzel's hanging around, like, this colony of wees. Yeah, I'm, just, I'm nowhere near strong enough to take on an alpha. We'll get there eventually, but... Not yet. This is sort of an in-between... Objective video and this reminds me of Pokemon snap seeing them on the beach like that like I I know what we need to do next for our main objective. It's just I want to get loaded up on items I want to heal our team. I want to level them up. There's just so many things I want to do before we get ready for that, you know Let's get shanks in there Nice we're able to battle him. I didn't think we'd be able to do it Don't run don't run Wow Guard up, guard up, and attack. Should be one at KO. Beautiful. Well done, Shinx. I have a Weasel too, don't I? Could have added a Water Pokemon to our team, but I just didn't really care to. I'd rather not have a water Pokemon on my team if it's going to be a Pokemon like that, you know? I, I have this thing where I like my Pokemon to be... Or my, my team to be Pokemon that I like. I'm just not particularly interested in... Uh, doing that, you know? Game Pokemon I don't like. Unless, like, I have no real choice. Like... If we're fighting a trainer that's pure water type or something, or a pure fire type, let's say, and I needed a water type, then I would get a weasel out for that. Okay, let's go heal up. I do like the day and night cycle, though. Crap. Is that it? What the hell? Is that a Inferno up there? Huh. If I go slow, I might be able to make it. Oh, I had that. I wonder if I just go super slow. Damn it. Oh, I know I can get up there. I want that as a fire type. He's just chilling, that freaking little monkey. Look at him. You little... Damn it. I have no way of getting up there either. Unless... No, I doubt it. The only way that I could is if I go up and around this. You saw it though, right? I saw his flaming tail and I knew right away what it was. That a boy. Does anything on it. Oh, he's strong, actually, level 12. If he hits me... Okay, tackle's not... Oh, boy. Come on. Defense curl. And what's left? That's a KO. <laughs> Damn it. 
All right, who do I have on my team? Uh, let's just run. I guess I could have used Drifloon, probably. You. Ah, oh, damn it. Uh oh. I want you, dearie. Ah, oh, damn it. Damn it. Had a shot. Completely missed it. Okay, was the Infernape down this direction? <laughs> or, uh, I said Infernape, but I meant Monferno, the middle one. My bad. There you are. Wait, what the hell are you? Oh, damn it, Geo, dude. You know, they say fire with fire. All right, let's do a rollout. Seems like a fair fight. Come on, dude. How do you do so much more damage than me? Why do my Pokemon suck so bad? So that should do nothing. Up in B. Nice. Got him on Ferno. I wonder if breeding is a thing in this game. I can't imagine. I mean, it would make sense that it would be, but I also totally would understand if it was not. Gotcha, punk. Oh god, they're gonna kill me. That almost could have totally taken me out. I feel like I'm gonna be playing this game forever. Okay, let's go heal our team up. Got a couple of KOs, and they need the experience. Oh, oh, oh. That's... Yeah, you're not going to give me anything. That's not Link. I do miss the do 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 do. Okay, first, why can I not remember how to make objects? Why do I not remember this? Crafting kit, that's why. Still, seems a little weird. I don't remember doing it that way, but whatever. Okay. Yeah, my team is super weak. We're going to have to find more potent challengers if we're going to level up properly. And we need to do so fast because we've got major stuff we have to do. Uh, flame wheel. That's a new move. I don't know how powerful this is going to be. That's not bad. Don't. Yeah, thank God you avoided that. Drowsy. Very nice, which means he's not ready yet for a complete KO. Let's see. Wait, did he fall asleep? Where's he KO'd? Too drowsy to move. Yeah, goodbye, Drifloon. Huh, he snapped out of it, I guess. And we... These Pokemon get burned so easily. I've never seen such flammable Pokemon. My god. That's a powerful attack. Come on. I 
took the hit for him. That's really cool. Burn was healed, huh? Uh, let's see, items. It's actually not a bad thing. You can actually jump in front to block their attacks. Oh, maybe not. That time I didn't. I thought I did the first time. Did I not? Am I crazy? There it is. We'll heal in a second. It looked like that's what I did anyway. Bit of a joke. A geo dude. Just collect the items that we can. At least it knew that I wasn't looking for a battle. Oh, there's something big here, huh? Not you. I hear something loud and powerful. Is it down there? Yes. Okay. Wait, hold on. What is... Map. Let's see. Glides so effortlessly, I love it. Okay, back out. Damn, it's far. It's a big tree, too. Drifloon some love here. Assuming it's a Geodude we're gonna fight in this thing. Yeah. I don't think a lot of the attacks are gonna do much against us. Confusion's gonna wreck him though. Well done. Drift King was able to take it down. Nice. What'd he drop? Tumblestone times 10. Looks like a Paris down there. Actually, that makes sense. If a Parasect is nearby, then it would make sense that Paris would be nearby too. Okay, they're also flying. Poison, but also flying. Which means P2 should be at the advantage. Okay, well, apparently not when you do that. How are you... I say, how are you alive? Just quick attack. Back to back. Damn. Yeah, thank God it avoided the attack. Almost. I wish someday that we, when we do a Pokemon battle, like once our Pokemon go live into the battle, we take their perspective and then we can like freely move about in the fight and just move however we want to. Like we can jump, we can attack, all that stuff. Freely. Kind of like a uh, Pokemon battle or Pokemon tournament. And I had that game, and I was looking forward to the possibility of that being like a really crazy uh, fighting game scene, and it just fell flat big time. I misjudged that one majorly. But that would have been really sweet. I have it. Barely touched it because of that, which sucks. Bunch of cricket tots. Burmy again, probably. I'm surprised it did that much damage. Whoa, that was a wild attack. And really cool looking too, actually. 
Burmy doesn't run. I'm going to burn this thing alive. Burn this thing alive. The lava is almost up to a level growth. Let's take the cricket tot. Let's collect all the items that we can. I don't want to leave any stone or tree unturned. You know what I'm saying? Actually, that's a complete lie. I did see some in the background. Oh, crap. Uh, all right. Shanks. Show me what you got against these guys. Level 16, huh? Look pretty effective to me. Ooh, Thunderfang. I should have done that. Try it again. Ooh, yikes. KO'd. Good night, ladybird. Oh, Star Raptor. I want you. Come on, big guy. Oh, I almost fell to my death. Fully evolved. <laughs> I just threw him off the cliff. He's dead. <laughs> I actually didn't mean to do it that time. I had let go just because I thought that. Okay, same thing happening. I will get this thing. <laughs> We're going to try to get this freaking bird. I, I will fall to my death and drown if I don't catch this thing. Oh, I thought that was close. That one didn't get it? Okay, let's... uh Inch closer. That's got to be it. Oh, you... Oops. Spoiled apricorns. I know that I can hit this with a ball. That's these are getting way too close, man. to time it just right dude how do i get you to have a slingshot can i hit you with something else oh god no damn it oh it brought me right back here very cool and i hit the wrong button i keep thinking x is up and i keep hitting y instead and he blacked out like a dumbass. Okay. How about we don't do that again? Where's our bird? Alright, Staraptor. That would have hit it. Come on! Okay, I'm pretty certain... That... We just can't get this thing. From here. Has to be right. Balls of mud. All right, little dirtbag. Let me see if I can get you this way. Come on, sir, Raptor. All right, fine. Damn it. Shut up. It's annoying. Nature's pantry, huh? Just chase him down. Yeah, what are you gonna do? <laughs> yeah, okay. Shinx, kill this thing. Thunderfang it. Bite his butt. Oh, he hurt me. Okay, I'm about to put you up for adoption, Shinx. Actually, this would be a good opportunity to take care of this thing. Dude, his cry is crazy annoying. Damn it. 
I didn't catch the alpha. I'm not, it's actually not even clear to me if I can catch alpha. Who the hell is that? If I can catch alphas? I don't know. I just don't know if I can. I mean, I don't see why not, but maybe it could also be what the heavy balls are for. Actually, is that it? Is that what the heavy balls are for? God, I never use this menu the right way. Um, everyday items. Where the hell are the heavy balls? Didn't she give me those? Okay, favorite, I guess. Although it is too heavy to fly high or far, but it's highly effective if you manage to hit an unsuspecting Pokemon. Why not? We'll make 20 of these. I guess we'll just make more. Okay. Who are you? What do you do here? Have you ever come across a tree shaking and swaying? I suspect that's because Pokemon are up in the tree, feasting on all its berries. Why are you standing here? Oh! Pikachu. <gasps> Lady Chew. Roll out. Should be a pretty devastating attack. I survived it. Nine levels above and still. So how does the paralyze work though? Like, do we shake that off? Or do we have to get a Paralyzed Seal? Because I haven't seen any items like that. What's in the bushes here? Is it... Oh, Cricket Tot. Okay, so what do we got? Looks like a Bidoof's butt over there. I know there was another Staravia over there, too. I think what we should do is this. Let me, every time I hit the wrong button, it just it feels more natural to hit the down button. Level 17, 16 shanks. Yikes, I, I hate that attack. Show me what you got. Beautiful. Bit his butt off. Ah, shanks can evolve. Let's do it, baby. First, that. Alright, this is perfect. Good timing for us to wrap things up, but let's do the evolution first. I won't leave you hanging on that. Damn it. Thought I hit the right button. Oh, this Starly can evolve too, so we're going to do both of them. I'm going to test this now to see if we can skip through the evolution process. Doesn't look like it. Oh, interesting. It starts to mutate or transform a little bit. Hmm. That's kind of cool. There we go. Shinx you as well. Cool, so we got a pretty decent uh, team here now. Well, semi in some ways. Let's heal them back up though. Perfect. We've gone over our time a little bit, but I hope that's all right with you. I'm good with it if you are. 
We will uh, continue on to play through with a new episode tomorrow. If you enjoyed this one, be sure to hit the like button. Do not forget to subscribe. If you have any feedback for me, leave it in the comment section. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Otherwise, I hope you're looking forward to the next episode of our Pokemon Legends Arceus playthrough. I know I am having a great time with it. Hopefully you are too. Anyway, that's it for me, guys. Take care of yourselves. Be well. And I will see you next time when we continue on with Pokemon Legends Arceus. Also, like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff. I forgot to say that. Okay. <laughs> all right, guys. Take care. Later.